there. Oh. Hi there. <laughs> How's it going? I've uh, I had to reboot my computer, so we're a little late starting up. And of course, uh, now that I've rebooted, I've got that whole every time I overlay over certain things, my audio cuts out bug. That my computer. Thank you. I don't want to update my browser right now. Thank you. Um, it does it does a thing where the audio will just cut out, and I've never really figured out what that's about. So that's fun. That's just a fun thing. Whatever. It's fine. Okay. I'm going to click that to go live over there. And I click this thingy. And I do this. Okay. And then I pull up Russell Quest and I hit play, and we're just going to get into it. We're just going to go. Oh man, I get a haircut tomorrow. Desperately need. How you doing tonight, Chucky? Pokemon Freak? How is everyone? <laughs> Jesus, that's loud. Oh my god. I'm so sorry I have to donate for us not to, uh, not to play this tonight. I don't know. There's probably a number. <laughs> I'll be honest. There's probably a number. I don't know what it is. It is finite. Yeah, there is there is a number. I will give you that. I don't know what it is. So, I mean, you could just start doing it <laughs> and see what happens, but uh, I don't recommend it. It's not a great course of action. Not a fiscally responsible one, by any means. Uh, okay. Let's just fucking do it. You know, I bet we could finish tonight if I just stopped reading every stuff out loud and instead just did the dang thing. All right, like that's probably possible. Not a chance. Again, you say that there, there's like, well, actually, no, there's like four and a half hours. No, so it is impossible. Oh, no. <laughs> well, there's one. Oh, good. Everyone's still injured and sucks. Oh, you go all. 4.5 hours. Okay, yeah, no. Oh, my God. Lochador, you're less than useless. Enemies that counter in this game is just... Shameful. Okay. Thank you for the sub dancer. That was not enough. Yeah, we're probably just going to die here, actually. Wait, what? Why did she defense down herself? That's weird. Is this game my purgatory? Yes, Indigo. This is my one game a year that I regret playing. I thought it was going to be uh, Mystery of the Druids, but here we are. <laughs> I'm just going to start doing bad things. Big damage. Actually, you know what? I should just be using the summons. Yeah, I should just be using the summons. At least the other QTs are still on. You've never played any other game. It's always been Russell Quest. We've always been at war with uh, Australasia. We've always been friends with Australasia. Okay. Okay. Look where you keep uh, delaying the inevitable. We've always been at war with Calgary. Exactly. Okay, we're just going to do the summons here. Uh, yeah. Chairs on everyone. 
We're almost done this game near as I can tell, Indiglo. In the grand scheme of things. What's wild is like on the dare drop, uh, on the dare drop uh, Discord, I have whined about the length of this game. And uh, apparently at some point it was mentioned somewhere that this game is like anywhere from 30 to 100 hours, depending on which, how you play, which is a stupid number, just a dumb number. Um, I'm like, I didn't read that. I don't know where that message was, but it wasn't in the general chat. Um, but also, uh, like, some people have managed to get through it uh, in, like, 30 hours. Another person did in, like, 60. It's like, oh, my God. Okay, you have to just keep healing, though. We're going to have to slow roll this a little bit to try and outdo it. Hello, TikTok person. Grilled cheese? I don't... Grilled cheese is great. I don't know where you're going with this, but uh, yeah. Grilled cheese, A+. Plus. I actually had pizza for dinner. Um, we're closer to the end than the beginning. That's true. That is true. Um, yeah, we're going to keep healing. Nope, 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 nope. Better bone. There we go. Uh, hi, you know, you're late. Turns out running a fever thanks to Booster is distracting. Yeah. Well, you know, take it easy. Okay, then punch this man to death. Uh, oh, no, I can't even do... Okay, I have to pin. All right. That's who you look like. Grilled cheese. <laughs> I think that's a little more hurtful than the other references. How you doing tonight, Eno? How you doing tonight, uh, Indiglo Dancer? Grilled cheese nuts. <laughs> uh, I shouldn't find that funny, but yeah, all right. Like, I really probably should be avoiding these fights, but also the game forces you to go through a lot of these probably to help keep you on level. Uh, do I have any? I have resets. Uh, oh, no, I got 50 super tapes. Never mind. So. Uh, okay. Do I have anything that hits everyone? No. Hold on. Mishnado, DDT. Oh, there it is. Corkscrew slow. Uh, sure, whatever the hell this one is. Yeah, Lotrador is absolutely useless right now. We're just going to keep using summons. I hope everyone likes this animation. You're going to be seeing it so much. Don't mess with my family. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, so pin you. Uh, also, Indigo, I will say, not that you, I'm, this is no pressure at all. Um, but if you're at all inter interested, we do have a Discord. Uh, you are welcome to join. If you so choose. You are uh, under no obligation to do so. You're just somewhat of a regular here, so I thought I would extend the hand of friendship. Okay. I guess that opened doors? Or pivoted doors. I don't know yet. I'm gonna have to put one back out and see what happens. Not sure. There's fucking... There's no reason for you to be here. Fix my link. Is it not working? That that link should is supposed to never expire.
Yeah, that just launched the Discord app. That launched the Discord app and sent me directly into the uh, the Discord. Yeah, it's still good. Yeah, yeah, Dancer. That that it's been used forty one times. Huh. There you go. I'm just gonna punch someone. That summon was less effective this time. It literally says link deleted on your screen. What? Dancer, are you using some kind of weird plugin for Twitch? Because I see it. That's very weird, Dancer. You're on mobile? I don't... I... Stream elements doesn't even show up on screen. What? It doesn't show up... No, it doesn't show up on... It doesn't show up on the... Uh, the comments on broadcast, but it should show up in the stream chat. Is it not showing up there? Because I see it. Yes, in chat. Yeah, I have stream moments filtered out uh, of the uh, broadcast. I didn't really see value in having the bot. That is very weird that that is happening, uh, Dancer, because I, I, it's not, <laughs> it's not deleted. You know what? Hold on. I'm gonna pull up the me on the mobile app. Uh, oh, maybe. Okay, hold on. Let's go to my channel. Go to the live. And then... You player will never finish. Hold on, let me just run the command here. Uh, I can't chat in my own chat. I don't want, why am I, wait, hold on. Is, I can't chat in my own chat? Because <laughs> it wants me to cheer? What the hell? Uh, okay, something weird is happening. Oh, it looks like new something for Lodrador. Adds 10 speed. Okay. I don't know what that does for me. Okay, hold on. What if I turn this... Oh, I can't turn it off. Okay, well...
Okay, that's mildly more damage. Works fine on iOS. Does anybody else with an Android uh, watching could that could look at this on mobile and see what's going on? That is very strange. I have an idea. Really quick. Hold on. a command copy this okay create a command I call this discord Let's try something. How's that one? Does that one show up for you to answer? I've also done that. So how's that look? Does it work now? I VIP'd the Discord. That also works. Okay, so I guess stream elements needed to be VIP'd. Hyperlink blocking isn't even enabled? Hmm. Maybe it's just some weird bug. Um. So, whatever. I will actually remove that one off of stream moments uh, at a later point in time. But, okay. There it is. And we should be able to post whatever spam links they want. Yeah, we don't, yeah, we don't, uh, disable links on, a, our thing. We're not, we're not, I don't know, popular enough, I guess, <laughs> for that to be a problem. Hello, Sid. Yep, indeed. Um. Oh, he's still standing? Shit. Thank you, Dancer. I am curious to know if that is a real website. Fucking, oh my god, the counters in this are just frustrating. The idea of you being .ca is very funny. <laughs> Proud Canadian content. That was also... See, I'm wondering if there's some weird bug where all links are just getting blocked out. Yeah, your client is, is messed up. Something is weird with your current setup. Oh my god, he keeps countering and this is so stupid. I wouldn't mind a counter so much if it wasn't also a miss. Okay, that's four in a row. This is just stupid. The game's just taking the piss now.
So I'm just going to use summons because apparently I'm not allowed to punch these men. Which is kind of ridiculous. I wish the game in any way explained how counter rates were calculated. Like, is it because bring speed is slow? And so that increases the chance of it? Like, I don't know. Game ain't telling me nothing. Thank you for the 100, I believe, test bits. I mean, the bits are real, but I believe it was done for a... Uh... Did it not play? I believe it did. I heard the noise. Yeah. It's just obscured by the various wrestling sounds. <clears throat> okay, so we can't get that chest yet because we have to find some other fucking thing. That's fine. That's fine. Oh, you didn't hear the TTS. No, it didn't uh, play the TTS. Huh. It sees it as gibberish. Uh, yeah, I guess it, it doesn't uh, recognize it as a pronounceable thing. Well, is there another torch? I'm just going to double check this area before I run to the next one. Because there's that guy there. He's got a door. Door needs torch. I see no other torches. So. Good evening, T3. Yep, that's a way to do it. I should see how Lothar's uh, healing is actually calculated, what it's based on, and then boost that. Good. Mm. Ow. That was so loud. Oh my god, I'm sorry. That was like the loudest possible thing. I don't trust it. I can't hit these guys, so I'm just gonna keep hitting them with chairs until we win.
Oh, he got another move. Okay. Uh... I don't know how you know. Oh, there we go. That's why um, Toy Box can't steal anything because the speed's garbage. Okay, so accuracy. His accuracy is 152 and he's, these guys are countering all the time. Oh, I can actually get dodge that. Okay. Oh, I forgot I have this. This is a mechanic I hate. Right, come at me, dog. Chairs will continue. Until morale improves. I mean, to be fair, Brink has like 700 and something AP. Which gets refreshed every time he levels up. So right now, I think we can just infinitely do it. Okay, so I think his healing is proportional to his power level. I say that because every time we get hit because of Elephant, we get more power. Like, our power just keeps ticking up. Um, and his initial heal is, like, just shy of 600, and now they're hitting close to 800. And the only difference is he got punched some. Okay, cool move. I'm going to try and hit this man. I swear to God, if he dodges, that's better. Consequences? No, just that one. Oh, hold on. Oh, what's in this one? Forgotten face cover. Oh, God, <laughs> that's haunted. Armoring then, da, 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 da. so what does it do? It lowers my armor, replaces power with speed in the damage formula. Oh, okay, hold on. That actually might be. Okay, 59, 17. Oh, 
This might make Luchador punch like a freight train. Hold on. Also, you should be wearing the elf helmet. That might actually be a big, a big deal. A fast freight train. Yep. Perhaps like a speeding bullet. Even slow freight trains punch pretty hard. It's true. Oh my god, Luchador's useful! <laughs> my boy, he's back! All we had to do was completely change his combat methodology. Who could have known? Been maxing in an RPG, I know. <laughs> what a concept. Yeah. In my defense, the game hasn't really given us a lot of items that do that action. I think this is like the third one through the entire game that has actually done that kind of a switcheroo. But it also means Lodrover can basically never take the mask off. Nobody cared who he was before he put on the mask. He's a luchador. You know what I meant. He already has a mask. Now he has new mask. Oops. That guy's hitbox was a little... Or detection box was a little bigger than I thought it was going to be. Alright. That's okay, because luchador does damage now. Look at him go! He actually moved the needle. I'll take it. I mean, to be fair, his calculation had a power of 18 and it had a speed of 59. So he's at least three times stronger than he was. Three and a bit times, right? And yeah, we, we see that reflected. The only thing is now the whole power up thing doesn't uh doesn't mean shit for a Lushador. Oh my god. I'm hoping I can KO this dude at the same time. Hey, there we go. Save myself a turn. Brink uses the maple syrup. He says it's his secret, but like, how does he utilize it? Or is that part of the mystery? Nope. <laughs> IV. Okay, there we go.
seems fine. Hey, he's getting away. Who? Let's tread carefully. Oh, God. Oh, my God. No. Where's the last one? Where's the last one? Fuck. Two, one, no, <laughs> you piece of shit. Okay, great. It's good to be free of those bars. How'd you know to come looking for us? I heard rumors. Your colleague Travis contacted my employer, Mr. Fawn. He said he had something that could help Mr. Fawn in his conflict with the brooder. What? Brink, you didn't say anything. We do. Before we, ta we were taken prisoner, we found the documentation we need to bury him. Excellent. Let's turn Mr. Fawn to your fellow mariachi. Ernesto Miguel. I thought you were trying to help San Sebastian, not destroy someone. Well, this will help San Sebastian. Forget him, Miguel. We knew he wouldn't understand. Maybe that's why Travis came to Pa, not you, Luchador. He knew who could really help him. Holy fuck, Brink. Just burning those bridges. Just absolutely burning them to the ground. The wrestling scene in Ochimachi is heating up, is it? Lots of action wow right now. Yeah, I'm curious to see who will come up on top. The Dragonback Band, uh, Undashu, or uh, the WFC. Uh, Hiroshi is in the only town uh, seeing some heat. There's a dramatic upset at the cross promotion rumble in Pond Fork. Ooh, I wonder what the fall of that will be like. Burning bridges is fun. No, it isn't. Nice work out there, Selene. I can't believe the Heike boys will disrespect the corner like that. You, what's with you trying to steal the victory and the spotlight? Maybe those antlers are affecting your hearing, Moose. Could you hear the crowd? The house are brimming with Haggy Boy fandom, like a steaming mug of warm coke. Chocolate. Get serious. The only thing's steaming. I've had enough of you and your insults. You should think hard about how you treat the best wrestlers in your father's promotion. Get over yourselves, Hungry Boys. Enough from the dog. <laughs> Stag might be the family dog, but Celine is the real. Oh. Yeah, shut about my cousin. Ah, he hit me. Defend ourselves, Lars. Can we finally just bury these men? Because that would be a real treat. I have no manager and no summons. So we're just going to do it the, hot, the old fashioned way. By shooting a man in cold blood. I don't think we've ever used this move before. Jesus Christ. That was a good chunk of damage. Ooh. I think we just keep doing it. We're just gonna just dump it all in. Just go for it. Oops, all special moves. I don't got time for these goofs. Hey, pin that dude.
Or they're gonna be like, we're going to leave and go join WoW or PA or whatever. And we're going to ruin your father's whole thing. Because I'm a little beach. There it goes. Oh, he's still standing? Oh, he is. He has like one HP. There we go. There we go. Stag, what is going on? He attacked us. What? Lars and Flores came in here and antagonized us for saving the snow brawl. Mr. Logan, this is unacceptable. I want him punished. Back down, Lars. You don't get to make demands of me. Especially after your behavior in the ring tonight. What was that? You want to cut all the goodwill we built with the WWE and the independents. You know what's going on in the wrestling world right now. We need to band together to avoid being swallowed up. This is unbelievable. Here we are, employees with a serious grievance, and all you care about is your corporation. I care about ensuring you and the other wrestlers have a place to work. Yeah, and buying that tramp of yours a new saucer of milk. Hey, <laughs> that's my mom. <laughs> that's my mom, you plump uh, piece of soft plastic. How dare you. Get out. What? I said get out. No one talks to my family that way. You're fired. Yeah. Well, I'm so sorry they said that. Oh, don't worry about me, dear. I made a certain stuff and they can hurt. Dad, that was awesome. Uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Logan, if I caused any trouble. No, Stag. You're the right thing. But what about our company, Pa? The Hagi Boys were a big part of the NCW. I uh, know. But I can't have people like that in my organization. People that are more concerned with their egos than what's best for our company and for all of us. For wrestling. We just have to figure out whatever's gonna, whatever we're going to do now. I'm glad we got to throw those guys to the literal dirt. Is it done? Did it work? Yeah, I like the work of a clock. And what about Stag? It took some work, but we got him to attack us. Excellent. And you hold up your side as a bargain? Of course. Paul is ready to greet you with open arms. Yeah, shocking. Fantastic. All this cold weather was starting to get to me. Save the game, dummy. I'll get there. Thank you, T3. Uh, problems are so much easier when you can just drop kick him. Hmm. <sighs> I've always preferred a good elbow drop. Sorry, overheard your conversation with that poster. Oh, uh, out of the ring, the problems got you down. What the click would you know about that old timer? Do you know who you're talking to? Who else can walk down the aisle looking like I do with $800 gators can choose? To answer that, you don't need hard work, you need talent. A dash talent. Here? In Ochamachi? Can't get anything past you, can we? So why the long face? Well, stable. You, you wouldn't understand. Try me. Come on, kid. I'll buy you a Mackie roll. Go to some person's shop. Okay. That's... Is that not this way? That's what I thought. Fifty hours. Good lord. Oh, for fuck. I can't walk through this forest. God damn it.
Hey, this place himself returns. How was the first day of the wrestler? Did uh, the power surprise you? Surprise you? It wasn't just the wrestling that was surprising me. It was the Wasabi Warriors joined the Yakuza. What? There's no way. He would have told us first. He would have discussed it. Zomi, I'm sorry. This is unfortunate timing. We, Honidashi, have a wrestling match soon. While the Yakuza are with the Yakuza stable. Mr. Vaughn, meet the Wasabi Warrior. Oh, and Chimachi's hottest spice. Well, he's feeling a bit mild right now. Is that so? Tell us about it. Dash and I, we've been around for a while. We might be able to help you out. Long story short, my friends just want to ride around on their bikes and slam a bit here and there. It makes some extra cash. They're in it for the fun, for the thrills. Me? I like to think bigger. I see. I respect that. I take it you had a falling out? I made a decision. They didn't like it. So I left him. No, that's not what happened. What? You didn't leave them. They chose not to follow you. See, kid, you're a leader, a trendsetter, a visionary. But you need to be surrounded by people who appreciate you. Oh, uh, I don't know if anyone would appreciate me right now. I do. I've been watching you, kid. I see it. I see the vision you've created. I think the world needs your type of alert of spice. The right type of spice. What do you say, kid? Come join us in Pa. Thank you for your words of encouragement. Hearing that from Legend Center yourself is, well, it means a lot. But you guys can suck my chopsticks. Whoa now, kid. I'm no kid, I'm a wrestler. As part of the Dragon Back Band, I will uh, redefine Purisu. First here in WoW, and then we're coming for the new elephant, you and Pa. He's, he's got cojones, I give him that. That didn't go as planned. No, but you ought to know by now, Dash, that I always have a contingency. What happens now? Oh, this fucking dude. We show that kid, and wow, what happens when someone won't support my vision? This is the business you're referring to? The uh, pachinko parlor? Are we going to research Valley's marketing strategy? Hardly. You heard the rumor, right? This place is a front for criminals. I'm not sure that increases its appeal. You're right. Unless you happen to be good for nothing in school uh, burning peanut liquor. The elephant? What is it you hope to accomplish? Do you remember... Uh, no. Dip wrong accent and slip into southern. Do you remember what Radcod said in Calgaria? Do you always listen to people like Radcon? Go on, help me look around. Jeez. Okay, I'm just gonna quick poke around here. Nope, oh, nope, that's how you leave. Oh, we found all the treasure in here. Okay, cool. <laughs> Follow the exclamation point. <gasps> Big Daddy Squeeze, he's so juicy. That's right. Come soak in some vitamin J. Gross. What's all the commotion about? Are you kidding? It's BDS, Big Daddy Squeeze. He's one of those popular wrestlers in Paw. Him? Why? It's not even anything special about him. Hey, no one can please you like Big Daddy Squeezy. Gross. Get some self-control and self-respect. You're in paw? Where's your boss? Where's the elephant? I'm a wrestler, not a secretary. You want a face-to-face? -face? Call his office. All right, enough shooting the breezy. Let's go get squeezy. Also gross. He continues to be gross. I found one of his lackeys, but not the hell of it himself. Uh, maybe it's best we didn't find him. Uh, we're alone. What could we possibly... Alone? Veneta, my whole career, my whole life, I've done things alone. I've had to. You can't rely on others, Veneta, ever. Jesus Christ. Everyone needs to have an existential crisis, right? That is one of the JRPG kind of tropes. You can't truly mean that, Bobby. 
They are a teacher. Isn't that what your students learn? Man, I learned from the beginning, from being a teacher. I want to make a difference, and I trusted that my colleagues want to do the same. But so many of them worried more about their paychecks than their students, or supporting the slogans of some group that doesn't give a brick about the kids. All it taught me is that I can only one I can rely on is me. I see. I wish I had your boldness or confidence. I can't imagine taking on the world by myself. And you'll never have to. What? Okay, let's go walk back into this room now. The deal I'm offering you two is for one deal, my friend. Just follow me outside and we can discuss the details. What? Okay. I guess we're doing that now. And is this when we get jumped? Check it out. Show him, Nez. Oh, this is an import. My boss is going to love this. How'd you get this past customs? Where there's a body cavity, there's a way, my friend. <laughs> oh, no. Ain't that the truth? And where's the rat? There's a stench. Dr. Jones, what are you doing here? Uh, then again, not much reason to stay back in Boxwood, is there? Unless you're a laundry enthusiast. <laughs> Shut up, Rodent. Part of the illegal toy trade now, is that right? I'm sensing some past history. Maybe I should go. Oh, the toy is just the tip of the iceberg. The toy box Jimmy gone. There's no one back in box with a police sheriff. I've been able to expand in all kinds of ways. Just watch. Oh my god. We're fighting him for a third fucking time. Okay, we're going to transform into an off-brand kitty and rocket everyone. I like how we just nuked him. Today's announcement? Hey, domination is the only way to run the class. He can counter? Huh. And now we wait for 10 seconds. I need to kill that unit just so he doesn't do this to us again. And that parrot is really coming clutch. Yeah, we're just going to do that again. Okay, he's dazed at the very least. That said, the little pawn has a lot of health. A lot more than you would expect. Oh, he's demotivated. That's fun. Lowest. Yeah, this fight ain't gonna be hard. It's just gonna take forever to do. I've got the guy stun locked. Uh, yeah, let's keep doing this. You skipped leg day. <laughs> Today's announcement? Hey. Excuse me.
I just realized she's saying real words. <laughs> I've only now just realized. I thought it was just like audio mumble. No, she just said, uh, all right, you asked for this. Yes. Hold on. Let's see if we can hear it again. It's just like extremely assorted. Hold on. <sighs> that was a different thing. Chris Tinko, do I take game recommendations? I mean, you can always say. I mean, tell me one. I'm willing to listen. Uh, though most of my most of my uh, game things at this point are effectively voted for via uh, via Twitch. But uh, you're welcome to mention a game. I can check it out. Lowest attack. The game is this. This is Wrestle Quest. It is a toy, to wrestling toy themed JRPG. Did you just counter the rockets? How do you even do that? Enjoy. Can you make your own signature move? No. Um, that being said, there are a lot of um, like actual wrestlers uh, featured in this. Uh, and doing some side quests with them, you can actually get them as, like, summons. Okay, that one, yeah, what she just said there is, oh dear, you, all right, you've asked for this. Uh, why can she not? Is she demotivated or something? Huh. Okay, I guess we just do this then. Can I suplex a train? God, I wish. All officially licensed? I mean, I have no idea if they got permission or what. Uh, oh, there she goes. That's fine. Um, there has been no train to suplex yet, which I think is a goddamn travesty. You play D&D &D and your wizard's basically a masked wrestler. You know what's funny? I was actually saying that somewhere else. Um, where it's like, I would love to make a wizard who actually has like a strength of 17. <laughs> I just think it's a really fun way to, to build like a wizard that has just a touch of, of barbarian in them or something. Not again. I think you put a kink in my tail. Okay, bye. Barbie, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks to you, actually. You know, this isn't the first time you've uh, been around to back me up. I guess there's at least one person I can count on. Maybe. Have I got the chance to play uh, BG3 yet? Nope. I'm, I'm not going to play that game for a very long time. <laughs> Uh, you're playing 3.5 and took a bunch of buff spells that grant bonus to grapples. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> you're a wizard that can absolutely do a brawl. That's fun. You have a plus 22 to grapple? <laughs> that's just that's just a silly modifier. Um, so taking care of that personal business? It can wait for now. Where's everyone else? I dash you as a Paroso match against the Dragonback Band. Tell me again, and I, I pretend I have no idea what those names mean. <sighs> Nozomi and her friends are supposed to have a wrestling match against the Yakuza stable, but Wasabi Warrior joined the Yakuza. Right, so drama. High drama. I 
I could be playing it if you wanted to. I'm not saying it's not worth it, Dancer. Um, I just don't have a lot of free time. Most of my free time is streaming. Um, or, you know, having a family. So, uh, I don't have the time to, uh, to invest in a, like, 100-hour <laughs> RPG at the moment. I would, I will play it one day. Uh, can I name this game? Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, WrestleQuest. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's the moment you've all been waiting for. A group match between two of the hottest, most exciting stables and warriors in Omotramachi Wrestling. In this corner, we have... Okay, Buzozo... Okay, can someone tell me how I'm supposed to pronounce that O? With the line above it. Buzozo... Is it U? I don't know. Let's see, my last uh, 3.5 character had a 28 hide at third level. Oh my god. He was useless and... I think it's a hard O, so like, Bozo... Uh, so, like, O, O, So, Zoku, Behemoths, and Mad Cat Motorcycle Gang, Onodashi. I'm sure, was she just doing, like, the crossover? <laughs> awesome. In this corner, you've seen their particular machines in every parlor, you've seen their mansions in every ministry, it's the Dragonback Band. Not sketchy. My ass, you can't be serious. Surprised to see me? I told you I made a decision, Nomi. Accept it. Uh, Onidashi is done. You actually fight against us? Against you? The way I see it, it's you two who are against me. I didn't leave you behind. I chose a path. You decided not to follow. Ladies and gentlemen, we can't let the fight go on with three against two. How's that for a decision, Spicehead? <gasps> ring the bell! Ring the bell! <laughs> oh shit, stuff's going down! Uh, pilots that came back from W2 were having problems readjusting society to the imported greaser culture. Wait, what? <laughs> what? Uh, okay, so... Could cause fatigue. Okay, I'm actually gonna try this. If I can fatigue the dude and then KO him, that'd be great. Oh, I don't get to control Slammerai. That's not great. And the fire starter. Eh. You get it, bomb, eh? Oof. Well, we're just gonna keep doing it. Okay, he's fatigued. I might be able to just KO him next round. That's the aim. 70. Fuck. Oh my god, Slammerai, you're pointless. Admittedly, he has 20,000 health. But, like, eesh. What'd that do? Oh. Oh, you healed him. But you know what? That no matter. I'm just hoping for a quick KO here. That would be fantabulous. Thank you, Auto QTEs. Also, our hype is just dipping because I don't think I set any of their uh, their methods. Uh, all right. Oh, 
Oh, cool. He has a healing move. Fantastic. If he could just spam that. Okay, he's fatigued. Okay, that's gonna get us through the five turns, yeah. All right, cool. Enough, let's end this. No, I said finish it. What? Are you blind? He's done. Defeated. I said finish it. Uh-oh. You will learn obedience. Oh! Whoa! Okay. Okay. That's cool. No. Sam, what have they done? Oh, my arm. Cut to commercial, cut to commercial. I mean, he just ripped a dude's to arm off. He's been disarmed. Uh, like, on camera. It seems like it might be a problem. Wasabi Warriors, stop. When I give you an order, do not hesitate. I understand, but... Your loyalty to the Dragon Back Man must be absolute. Do you understand? Okay. All right, cool, man. Just saw your friend's arm got ripped off and you're just like, cool with that, huh? All right. All right, all right, all right. Please, not another driving game. I hate the driving game so much. Oh, good, you're back. Excellent, great. I'm just gonna skip this. The second I can. Hitting, oh, cool. I don't know if hitting people is good or bad. I don't know if that's points or not points. But I'll say I, I also don't care. Because it doesn't matter. Because I'm just going to skip this game the second I get an opportunity. Oh yeah, people are negative points. That's excellent. Oh, there we go. Good. I skip. Can I skip now? Fantastic. Skipping it. It said in the tutorial that it was bad. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's, it's, it's alarming. Oh no. Uh, hitting people in real life gets you points. The more traffic infractions, the more severe... Yeah, sure. Sure. Oh, now we're fighting this dude? I did say I was gonna kill him, so like, alright. That was the wrong move, though. I meant to do the other one. It's supposed to be this one. I don't know if I'll be able to fatigue him, though. But it does do a buttload of damage, so it's fine.
Wait, did it actually say in the tutorial that it was not a good game? Or a good mini game? I don't recall that. Oh, is he fatigued now? Oh, hitting people is bad. Oh. I don't remember. <laughs> there we go. Speed through that bottle a little bit. Stop. Do you know who I am? You signed your death warrant, child. And for mercenary assassin for miles, we'll be after your head. Okay. Stop. How can you let him do that to Slam? How can you let him do that to us? Enough, Nomi. It's him. Not It's not him, it's me. This is my decision. It's my future. And Jasu's dead. It was just a child's fantasy anyways. You want to drive around these same streets doing petty crimes and sleeping on Jeruma's floor? Wake up, Nomi. Then grow up. <laughs> Don't worry, we'll kill him at some point in the future. See? I told you we could count on Brink to rescue your friends. And to bring me a hammer to crush the brooder and Machacho Man. I can't wait for whatever this news is going to be to come out. And everybody's going to be like, oh no. And Machacho Man's going to be like, whatever. You're my friend. The power of friendship will save the day. And this is just going to be a whole big nothing burger. You're safe. Did you get it? See. I must admit, I'm curious to see what this is all about. All in good time, Brink. You've done well, my champion, which is why I'm reluctant to send you away again. Good, you're going home. I'm sending you to Pond Fork. Brink, I'm afraid you're a cousin stag. He's broken his paw contract by engaging in a wrestling match with the Heige boys. I need you to go and terminate his employment. Okay. Will that be a problem? No. I know where my loyalties lie. Man, he's just the worst, huh? Now, my mariachi friends, tell me what you've discovered. Okay, such brutality. Ending another wrestling career like that. Have you seen anything like this, Bruder? Rarely, almost never. When it does happen, it's not out of anger or vengeance because something, someone is making a statement or sending a message. So what was Oya oh, um, oh, yeah, Bun saying tonight? That only Dashi is dead and that Waz belongs to him. Waz? I guess Waz, not Waz. All my life, Oya Dashi was all I ever had. All I've ever known. Running with Slam and Waz, that was the uh, life I could ever picture. But I guess Waz won a bar. Something else. I don't know if he wanted this, though. Whatever he wanted, it's not. Uh, it, it, where... <laughs> But whether he wanted it or not, let it, he let it happen. All part of his decision. Mm -hmm. I've decided something too. I'm not going to let him get away with it that easy. I'm going to make him pay in the ring or outside it. If you want to do it in the ring, you may have to wait a bit. Those represented from Mystery of Wrestling. Oibun has suggested an intercontinental three-on-three -three match to determine pachinko rates here. If the Dragon Backbone wing wins, we can't put up our pachinko machines anywhere. Goodbye, big marketing break. And all the work we've done to push the FWC to Omichimachi. Okay. Sounds like an ambush. Sounds perfect. Little Oyabun stack the deck and lay a trap. We will still beat him. Our victory will be all the more meaningful. Count me in. That's part of the FWC. I knew Dashu might be dead, but that doesn't mean we can't have our revenge. <laughs> what was that? That was an extremely pained OC. Spoken like someone with space in their belly. Alrighty, amigos, let's show the wrestling world what we're made of. Okay, uh, inventory. I have a reset button. I'm just going to burn that on her right now. Uh, okay. Let's have a look at everyone's thing. We need to get her better armor. Yeah, you can wear the power kimono. Everything else, I guess, is pretty okay. Oh, yeah, what the hell? Brooder's not set as a powerhouse. Fuck's sakes.
Gonna make her a technician. All right. Can we finish this part of the story? I mean, probably not. This isn't going to be the final fight here in o Omichimachi. Save the game. I dummy. just did. <laughs> I just did. I was responsible. Actually, hold on. I'm going to be more responsible and we're going to go to the shop and buy some crap. Actually, it's fine. A uh, whole chunk of those. There we go. Whole big stack. All right. Got a bunch of healing items. Got some revives. There you go. This program, you always save twice to make sure the same does a save. Mm, nope. Don't do that. But I had also never really claimed to be a pro gamer, except in absolute jest. Okay, no one be except I'm expecting to zombie, so let's have her jump in after you guys get into the ring. Should generate a big pop for our hype. I could also do that curse I mentioned before. Kidding? But Josh, man, you can't let him do something like that. Figure Wrestling Coalition needs all the support we can get right now, Barbe. We need a big surge in popularity from this match. Leave it to me, Judge Man. Oh my god, Barbe. Barbe's annoying me. Excuse me, Spice Brooder Hood. They're ready for you. Okay, get in. This is the place. Oh no, you're not part of Dragonback Band, are you? What? The wrong locker room. Okay, so we didn't do the thing anyways. Okay, whoops. Ladies and gentlemen, I said a bunch of stuff. The first team tonight is the Spices Crew and Wrestling, inspiring little brothers and sisters all over the globe to make their vitamins eat their peppers. It's the Spice Brooderhood. Okay, I, I just want a different song. Where is that? There we go. They've reworked that menu a little bit, I think. It's been a while since I've actually looked at it. You should just skim over it. Oops, all fireworks. I love it. Step back before the bruiser cuts loose on you. Head down the mat and pick up your peppers. It's time for spice. There's opponents tonight, straight up from the worm's lair with a horde of championship belts and glittering silver of pachinko balls. It's the Dragonback Band. Tonight, Machacha Man, everyone's going to find out who the real spice is. Fuck, I don't know. This one sounds fancy. All right. Oh, it looks like there's only two of you. I hope you have the strength to keep up. I learned I'd be more worried about our speed. I mean, it's a cool intro. No, what are you doing? Making a decision, you traitor. Oh, my maker. Ms. Nozomi has joined the Spice Brooderhood. She's ready for battle. Let the fates of Pachinko be decided. Let's get it on. Hope we can do some tag team. We've done like two tag team matches in this entire game. Uh, okay, what can I do here? Uh, we're gonna keep going. 
We're going to keep on trying to do the fatigue KO thing. Because it's great to do an early out if we can do that. Uh, this is a finisher and has a chance to KO the target if they are fatigued. Uh, I'm not actually going to do that yet because I don't need to heal. So it's not really going to do much for me. Oh, it highlights the people now. Uh, uh, might kill the dude as he said it wanted to. Yeah, you know what? I think I'll tag team. I'll, I'll, I will do a tag team to do this. Because this one can also have a chance to KO and doesn't do a heal. Is that a turn one knockout? It's a good system. Okay, let's just keep trying to do it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's only a chance to KO, though. Oh, didn't get him. Do you have anything that can do that? No. Well, we'll just keep beating him up just in case we don't get to KO him. Is that all you got, man? Is that it? There is only room for one true champion. You can hear yourself. Okay. <laughs> Fuck. It's ridiculous. Do you have a fatigue maneuver? No. Okay. That's fine. We'll just do a regular. Time for a sleep. Do you have one that can do? No. Oh, you know what, though? I can just do this. Take all the hype. And... Destroy a man. Yeah! <laughs> just a casual 10,000 damage. That's fine. I didn't fatigue him. Easily 13,000 damage, yeah. They've done it. The Spice Brewerhood has won. Say hello, new Prince of the Pachinko. Go to the Pachinko parlor. Okay.
This is incredible. With Oyavan and his crew defeated, Daruma can finally get back to his craft. I must admit, I'm excited to make new creations, especially after working with friends such as you. Between our victory and a new fighter and this awesome new machine, we'll be getting tons of new fans in the Spice Murder Hood. There's only one spice in the and it's green and mean. Still going, huh, bud? Shut up, we overgrown radish. We destroyed the back, uh, dragon back band. Fair and square, and they're in the ring. We earned the right to set up this machine. You think I care who sit in the ring? This isn't wrestling, Kaijin. It's real life, and I control everything in this town. Destroy it. You gotta pay for what you did to slam our IX. You can stop me? Stop all of us? I mean, yes. I think I actually have that handled. Wait, did you hear that? Destroy them. No, wait. Oh, yeah, bud. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? Is that what you wanted? This is all part of your decision? I know that sound. I've heard it before on a mission. No, you the bike game. What about it? Never would have been enough. Wow, those are your, that's what you want your last words to be, huh, man? An interesting choice. Hi there, I'm here for a kaiju orientation. Can you help fish out? <laughs> what? When? <laughs> so, someone bought the kaiju clash? Who? <laughs> Ugh, thanks for nothing, small package. <laughs> that surprise was pretty good, though. <laughs> Gee, I wonder who had the money to buy it up. Hey, Mackie Murata, what's this about someone purchasing the Kaiju Clash? Yeah, we just got news today from uh, what I hear, the new owner has some big shakeups in mind. Shock. Shock. New. Hello, Red Card. Funny. I haven't seen you around much. Not around my waters, anyways. But my ears tell me you've been swimming with a certain spandex and spice enthusiast. And yet here we are, our currents bringing us together once again. It's like our fates are intertwined. Okay, at this point I'm not sure if you're threatening me or hitting on me. I'm sorry, I haven't been around much. I've been training for the Kaiju Clash. I managed to get in, so... Oh, you must be here for orientation then. I'm afraid we won't be needing you. What? <laughs> hey, look, the game does have a sense of humor. <laughs> it took 50 something hours, but there you go. It actually it landed a joke that made me laugh. Why well, restructuring Kaiju Clash? All the wrestling in Omichimachi actually instituting a new culture, one based on loyalty. Which means there's no place for fish like you. You're free to go, though, unharmed. Consider a farewell present for all your past service. Okay. Now we have to walk all the way out of town. Oh, there's the one treasure chest. We did it. God, I hope I'm into episode 15 at least by now. <laughs> Which way's faster? Maybe this way? Not even close? How is that possible? Oh, uh, El Pescado. We're kind of, kind of in the middle of something here. You and me both. The elephant just bought the kaiju cash and kicked me out. I'm sorry to hear that, Radcom, but Sabi Warrior is dead. Oh, you've been too. They were assassinated. You can bet the elephant was behind that, too. The elephant hates competition. He buys it when he can, like he did with the kaiju clash, and when he can't, well, things have a way of falling into place. So the elephant was behind the killings, and you're out to stop him? 
then I'm coming with you. The last thing Waz said before he died was that his life here would never have been enough. He wanted more. He thought Oibun could give it to him. He was wrong. Me? I don't want more. I just want revenge. Ah, yes, the tragic female hero character from Asian culture. You can count me in too. You. She said there's no point trying to take on the elephant. You said it was impossible. Maybe I did. Or maybe it is. Yeah, she wants revenge. Um, I thought I'd get by surviving outside of shadow, but then you took the only thing even close to chance for happiness from me, so well, here we are. Clearly, his shadow will only grow. There's no escaping something like that. No hiding from it. Might as well try and take a stand, even if we all die in the process. Ah, yes, the begrudging anti-hero. <laughs> a shadow. <gasps> Inspirational speech time? When shadows loom large, engulfing you and everything you know, there's only one, two things you can do, amigos. You can give in to them, or you can become a torch. Do not lose heart, amigos. Do, needs better music. Needs, needs a swelling band. No give up on the spice just yet. I swore I would become the greatest wrestler this world has ever known. I will take on every contender, every adversary. And that includes the ones pulling the strings. The ones that seem to have fate itself in their peanut-licking trunk. Man, they're really hard on this peanut-licking thing, huh? We can beat the elephant. We will. To save the toy room from his grip. To save ourselves in the same wrestling. Oh, see! We get a chance sooner than you think. That was Helfen's people. He wants a match on their turf in Chokeslam City. Did you hear that? Their turf. Space is the place, but I'll crush them if that's what they want. Excellent. It's the perfect place to reveal the Helfen's machinations. Oh, yes. <laughs> okay, and back to Brink. Oh, it's Brink. Welcome home, champ. The sun. Mm, wow. It's a big fancy title belt of yours. Come on. You think I take it with me everywhere? How are things here? Actually, we're a bit of crisis control. The Hag Boys and the Rigos became too much to handle and we cut them loose. And now we're in a bit of a tight spot. Since uh, they were our biggest straws. Say, maybe the champ could make an appearance? What an event that would be. Uh you know what? Let's make Brink uh no, that's fine. I'm not I'm not here for that. Besides, it'd be a violation of my contract, which is why I'm here in the first place. By wrestling the Hagi Boy, Stag violated the terms of his employment. He's done. What? You're here to fire Stag? How could you do that? He's your cousin. Frank, that's not how we raised you. <laughs> now you raised me, eh? Funny. Search the bedrooms for Stag. Okay. By what you mean, I'm just going to follow the exclamation point. Son, we never taught you to turn your back on family. We taught you to have a vision for your family and sacrifice for them, serving them. We taught you that family is everything. No, the only thing you ever taught me was how to lose to people who are willing to lick your boots. Brink, what's gotten into you? Stay out of this, Mom. I give my blood and plastic, my heart and soul to NCW just so you can fill your pockets. Son, you can't mean that. What about your speech at the championship when you won the belt? All the things you said about learning from me, about technical wrestling, the soul of the sport. Everything I taught you is father and son. I said exactly what everyone expected me to say, and that's it. Cool. I know Brink is going to have another pivot to like, oh my god, I was so wrong. Please forgive me. Quite frankly, I don't want him to have that forgiveness. He has become such an unlikable character that I am forced to pilot. Come on, Dad. You ought to know better than anyone that wrestling is just lies and manipulation. Brink, what are you talking about? It's fiction, sure, but... Talking to you, manipulating me for years, taking advantage of me. Okay, cool. I wish we could just have this whole conversation in one fucking spot. 
Like adults. Instead of making me walk back and forth between two maps. Three maps, sorry. Walk back into the lodge. Like, what are you doing? I've always done the best. Better than the Haggy Boys. Better than any of the wrestlers in the toy room. But you had me jobbing to them all. All because you were holding me back. All because you were jealous. Oh my god. Jealous? Jealous that I was better than you. Than your promotion. Too big for the NCW. Well, here I am now, Dad. The Paw Heavyweight Champion. The greatest wrestler in the toy room. The very best. Prove it. I've heard everything, Mr. Big Shot. Do you want me to quit? Fine. Wrestle me for it. You and me? In a shoot? You can't be serious. Guys, stop this. Yeah, boys, please. Let's all just calm down and talk this through. You're supposed to be the master of technical wrestling, right? It's all about your performance in the ring, eh? You know it. I didn't claim to be the master of technical wrestling. The only reason you're wearing the championship belt is because of the work you do in the shadows. Face it, Brink. You're no champion. No professional. You're just a hitman. <sighs> no, I'm not you want to take on the champ? Let's do it. Okay. Gonna let him do it. Think they hurt? Come on. Why not try the pendulum backbreaker move? Contract fulfilled. You're literally asking me to break you right now? Yeah, man. Showing that you're willing to just beat your own family up. All of your hitman moves. I actually really like this. I like what Stag is doing. enough? Not quite, but you never could finish the job, right? Screw you, Stag. Get ready for the silencer. Okay. Bonk. Where is the silencer? Uh, I need the hype to be greater than 24. Shit. Hold on. I have to taunt for like seven move <laughs> rounds. Oh, actually, no, I think I can... Yeah, I can just do this. I can use Elephant to do this. Okay. Okay, it's 28. Now I can do it. Where is it? There it is. Eighteen thousand damage. <laughs> that shipped you up, didn't it? Yeah, you beat me. Say goodbye to your co paw contract. Using the moves your father taught you. Well, I, you say you're the best. Well, you're right. You just forgot who made you the best. Brink. We... Yeah, get fucked, Brink. Eat shit and die. 
fall down a cliff. Look, can this wait? Uh, Brink, are you okay? You sound terrible. I'm fine, sir. The stag situation is resolved. Tremendous. I knew we could count on you. I got run paw without you. Why is Mr. Brink Robotnik? Uh, basically, at some point, Brink just had a complete heel turn uh, in the span of, like, one, one dungeon, actually. He went in as one dude and then just pivoted to uh, drinking from Helifant's, uh poisoned teat and was just, like, instantly shitty to uh, Stag and everyone. And since then, he's just been a complete tool. Thank you, Mr. Font. I need you to return to Chokeslam City. I can't say words. Chokeslam City. Our situation has become is coming to a head. Okay. And now Stag's dead? No, probably just crippled for life. The weight of the belt has become ponderous for the champion as he returns to his master. The same master wrestling's uh, savior comes to challenge. Two heroes join together, but not by fate, but by script. Choke Slam City, Choke Slam City, Choke Slam City. We tell Choke, so, choke Slams, and that's not all. Or, in that, or that's all. Fuck, I missed it. I screwed it up. I'm sorry. Okay, first we're going to go and heal. Actually, let's set our team up. Toy box? Fuck that noise. Uh, okay, still like Veneta. Wait, where's Bruder's assigned? Where's Bruder? What the fuck? Uh. What? Okay, the game is broken. Do I want Bruder or Nozomi? I do kind of like Nozomi's two, two step kind of thing. And odds are we're going to lose Bruder in a little bit. Yeah, let's just do this for now. Uh, actually, what kind of... You know what? I'll just use a reset. I don't need to find the, the healer. We're just going to go. <laughs> okay, so I need to go to Chokesam City. Oh, actually... No. I take it back. We're going to go to Pond Fork. Hear me out. I know that there's a power-up for Veneta in there. I just got to get to it. Hold on. Inside the lodge, there's a... Where the hell's the lodge? Uh, okay. Inside the lodge, inside one of the rooms upstairs, is uh, a metamorpher thing that I can easily get to. So I'm going to grab that. And then we're going to go to Shook City. I know there's another metamorpher in uh, Junglaji. One of the things that we can use by being clear of what it was for? Yes. This thing. So. Sorry, I have to swap people around here. There we go. Yeah, we didn't have Veneta. Now we have that. And there's one in Junglaji. I don't think there's an easy way to get to Junglashi, though. <laughs> Oops, nope, wait. Have to go down, right. No, yeah, you know, you weren't wrong. It's just when we ran into them before, they were kind of like hinted at, like, hey, there's this thing that 
a metamorpher could get. And uh, then we didn't get a metamorpher for like 25 hours. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, T3. You wanted to go bed an hour ago, but your cough's not letting you. I'm sorry to hear that. This illness really has its uh, talons in you, huh? I don't even remember how to get to Junglaji. That's the other thing. It's like, I do not know how to get there. There's an incredibly increasing chance that I get pneumonia from this. Out of curiosity, is there any chance that, like, everything that you are doing, like, all the medicating of trying to slow it down and all that, is actually having a counter effect of prolonging the illness and, or, like, Basically, bringing you close to having closer to having pneumonia as a, a a side effect of trying to minimize other stuff. You're playing into the disease hands exactly. It wanted you to do this the whole time. Uh, stop taking medicine. Vacation when the symptoms went away, and right now I only have the tiredness and weakness, but my nose is dry. My nose is dry. Mm hmm Like, I have found if I get a cold and I use too much um, uh, decongestant to, like, stop. I love that you're in a completely different set piece every time I join the stream for this game. The game does not end. So, apparently Brink beating the shit out of his cousin using his dad's moves without realizing it might make him not suddenly be a jerk, but quite frankly, I don't think he's earned it. But like, uh, T3, when I have like uh, a congestion cold, um, they always tend to live in my sinuses. And if I take too much like antihistamines or decongestants or anything like that, I'll actually give myself a sinus infection because it slows everything down and causes the, uh, the virus or whatever to get to live and, and embed itself in my sinuses. All right, we have a little bit of time, but we should head to the arena quick. Yeah, we're just gonna go to the arena. Everyone's healed. It's not like Chokes him, so he's suddenly going to have new items for me. Info that only means something if the Sardu Nude got the tea set as my uh, Feast of the Winter Star gift tonight. Yeah, I don't know what that means because I haven't played Stardew in a long time. I don't even remember tea set being a thing so i don't know what that is but uh it sounds cool so congratulations max mm -hmm. that sounds like it is a difficult thing to get where's green gene why is there no announcer yes the toy room needs to hear the story of elephant's machinations something's wrong whenever a palm match doesn't start playing you know something bad's about to happen oh no Oh, wow, they're actually going to broadcast his shame live. Wowzers, Bowsers. Did you forget about us? How'd they get in here? Who let them on the ramp? I did. These mariachis are my honored guests. Their paws, messengers. Man, you are making some unbelievable and drinking announcements, but no one cares about paws staffing arrangements. They're waiting for me to put one, two, three on some paw scum. Oh, I agree. I agree. The Paw Universe is here to see a Titan toppled. In the interest of fairness, maybe we should go get a chance to topple one. Get him out of here now. We've been lenient. So very lenient. But you refuse to make a right. Refuse to balance the scales. I'm sorry, if you want money. <laughs> I have money. <laughs> but it's time for the truth. I can't wait for this to be not nearly as important as it is. Paw Universe, people of the tournament and beyond. You've heard the scandal of El Padre de Luchador. But do you know the man behind it? You want the culprit? You want to know the truth? Look no further than underneath that purple mask. Bold claims from Bobblehead Beat Junkie. You can't just throw accusations like that around. Of course not. Not without proof. My brother has now recovered photographic evidence from a witness from that terrible night. Look at the man here. Look at him. Oh, 
Oh, my maker. It's the Brooder. Brooder, is this true? I didn't mean to hurt him. You heard it here, Paul. Universe, the Spice Brooder is behind one of the vilest fellows most loathsome acts in wrestling history. Unbelievable. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Can't believe this. You're a PR nightmare. The smartest thing to do would be to kick you to the curb. I know. What? Seriously, you just abandoned him? I just knew there was something off about you. Fuck. Oh my god. I'm getting so tired of some of these characters just not growing as people even an ounce. Take it easy, private. Jimmy, we can't just turn on each other. Forgive me for interrupting, but can someone please explain what's happening? I'm afraid I'm unfamiliar with this El Padre de Lochador business. This is back when I was someone else, when I was a star, a wrestling hero, one of Pa's favorite wrestlers. I had headlining bouts every week, but the fame got to my head. Oh. Half this cast is just the worst? They're all... The, half this cast are fucking children. <laughs> like... They just act like petulant children. Go to Mira Cantina. Okay. I go there. Still level 32 Brooder, though. Do we get to see Sephiroth destroy a town? No, this town's still standing. During a tour through Malibu Heights in San Sebastian, a disagreement broke out with this tough guy. We fought, and during the battle, I removed his mask. <gasps> I thought that was the end. When there's someone with a camera. Then those mariachis came out, saw El Padre's mask, and figured it out. At first, nothing happened. Then El Padre disappeared, disgraced by his unmasking, and everyone assumed the worst. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, Randy Savage. <laughs> All right. Those mariachis have been blackmailing me ever since. At first I could afford to pay them, but then I lost the Stone Age cotton at Summer Suplex and my career slowly dwindled. Oh, Bruder. That's an awful situation. Are you really surprised? Look at him. He's a bad guy mustache for Brick's sake. I've been on the run ever since, taking dives and ringing bets to pay them off and keep them at bay. But that changed when I met you, Machacha Man. You're the first friend I had in... I don't know how long. So I figured I could make a new start. They didn't have any hard evidence, right? Your courage, your, your hope, inspired me. I was done with running, done with doing the wrong thing, and I still am. My heart, these 44-inch adders, beat only for the Spice Brooderhood. You were wrong, though, weren't you? They did have our evidence, and now it's come to light. We can't keep him around. The FDC may already be destroyed because of our association with him. You can't do that to him, Machacha Man. Yeah, I'm walking shooting proof that people can change. He's a disgrace to wrestle, Machacha Man. Dump him. Who cares about wrestling? We need strength to stop elephants. Who asked you, Worm Breath? Oh my god. The brooder goes. He must. If we want to beat the elephant, we have to reserve our promotion. Okay, now Machacho Man's being. <sighs> and I mean that just like. <sighs> I hate. I'm hating this writing. I'm hating this writing. I'm so frustrated with this game. I apologize for my language. Enough, the brood goes. Great. Yay, B, Eli. I can't believe you, Jimmy. Now's not the time to turn on each other. Ah, come off it, Dr. Jones. You're not my teacher anymore. You can quit anytime. 
I gotta see this through. But honestly, at this point, I'm very frustrated. There doesn't need to be this. This drama is not adding anything at this point. It's just insipid. <sighs> You're not my teacher anymore, so just cut the mentor crap, okay? Well, who are you to try and advise me? You don't take advice or help from anybody. So yeah, the whole team's gonna fucking fall apart now. Where are you going? I'm not sure. I just don't believe I can provide any more value to this group. Veneta, don't say that. Enough, James, please. I'd figure this out myself. No one but me can help me. Gee, I wonder where she learned that. Some mentor you are, Dr. Jones. You should be real proud. You're making quite an impact. Private, hold up. Cool. See what you did, Barbie? Don't you start, you spike junkie. If you hadn't run this, ro run this promotion a little better, we wouldn't have been in this position. Enough, you two. All the shouting. No, you shut up, Machacho man. From the moment I met you, you wanted to be a hero. The greatest hero the wrestling has ever seen. Do you heroes turn their backs on their friends when they need them most? But a promotion, the FJC, is the only way to stop the elephant. When did that become more important than being a hero? The brooder helped you. Helped all of us. Disowning him just for publicity's sake isn't something the Machacho man I know would do. Sounds more like something the elephant would do. Anyone else you want to see leave? Yeah, myself. Okay, cool. That was unexpected. What happens now? I don't know. I did say, like, how, like the people in this game are children. <sighs> okay, whatever. That was better than expected. It certainly had the intended effect, but was it necessary? Are you kidding? By crushing the brooder, we just crushed Machacho Man and the FWC. Adults in real life fight over the most childish things as well. That yes, you're right. But I guess this is what happens when you have an entire team who cannot communicate and have absolutely no emotional growth over the over the course of their entire friendship. Which, I mean, can happen with adults as well. But the brooder, he gave Paul many good years. Uh, maybe you could have encouraged him to make it right. Besides, you don't really care about what he did. One, they know someone's a spy and did the whole thing theatrically for Helifin, or they're all just stupid. Honestly, Eno, I don't believe the first one. That's it. If it is the first one, that's still going to suck because what a deus ex machina it's going to be. Because we have been shown, like pretty much everything in this game from everyone's perspective so the fact that we didn't see that being planned just so it could be a big reveal still sucks because it's stepping outside of its own structures of storytelling just for us a, uh, a, a surprise maybe too well how'd you get in here i'm gonna stop you elephant for your crimes against wrestling crimes against wrestling are you kidding you do like the dialogue between Elephant and Elephant? Yes, I do too. I lifted it out of the gutter. Out of the fire halls and school gymnasiums, I put it on the pedestal it deserves. Without me, without Pa, all these wrestlers, people like you, used to be slamming each other in the backyard. You should be thanking me. Needs a few more Golem Golems. Uh, I'm, I'm registering it more like Two-Face as opposed to Golem. Don't you turn your back on me, Elefante. So is this when uh, Elefante's going to beat the living piss out of me? Or is that when we fight him for the eighth time later? I'm just going to punch him, see what's up. Trunk bomb. Okay. Let's see what he does. Okay. This is going to be a whole not my final form kind of thing, though. There's no way we just fight Elephant once. Oh, that's a really good voice for Helifant. I wish any of the voices were actually narrated in this game so I could know what they were. 
Um, because like, yeah, of course he sounds like a gangster. Why wouldn't he sound like a gangster? Why did I give him the voice that I've given him? <laughs> I don't know. Miss Rump, what's going on? Brink, the make maker, you're here. The psychopath attacked me. Psychopath, you haven't seen Spice Madness yet, amigo. Uh, here we go. Except, oh, now I'm playing as Brink. Stay out of this, Hitman. Shut up! Don't call me that. What the hell's wrong with you? The hell event is evil. Can't you see that? Oh, and you're a hero attacking a poor old man in his home like this. Okay, whatever. Now, all of a sudden, Machacho Man has more health than he usually does. And is weaker. And he uses more special moves. I've been using more special moves. I have been using them. I'll never let you hurt Mr. Font. Back off, Brink. I'll destroy you if I have to. Hmm. Two champions destroying each other. Don't. The perfect ending. Yep. i uh, send you both out the window. Sir, Iron Larm, you okay? Yes, I feel wonderful. What happened? It was better than I could have written. Sir? There's no need to be subtle anymore. Chacho Man is defeated. Our champion Brink, Brink Logan, the leader of Paw, saved us, but it cost him everything. <laughs> yeah, you were being subtle before? <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Subtle as a Mack truck in a china shop. Two champions stepped into the arena, but Paw emerged the victor. You're into this sequence. This, honestly, is a better sequence than a chunk of the game has been so far. Anyways, one month later. Joining us today to talk about the disturbing events from a few weeks ago are two of Pa's biggest stars, Dash Talon and Big Daddy Squeeze. Mr. Talon, you were there that day. Perhaps you could explain exactly what happened in the Paw offices. The wrestling world wants you to know. Of course. The drained spice said Machacha Man. Trespass in the building and attack Mr. Font, the owner of Pa. Thank the maker that Brink Logan was there to save him. What happened to Brink? The Paw champion saved Mr. Font and saved Paw, but it cost him everything. Never in my years of wrestling have I seen something so bold and so tragic. Truly. But why why would Machacho Man really attack the Hellfant? What did he have to gain? Did he just snap? Hey, are you sympathizing with him after what he did? What? No. Anyone who doesn't support Paw right now is crazy or worse. They're guilty as Machacho Man. That's... All for our show today. <laughs> Just and we're gonna go. <laughs> Ugh. Turn the podcast off, Phil. That sounds like paw fat <laughs> fiction is chafing my gills. Sorry. I just wanted to see if they're spouting anything new. Well matter. Not for Phil tells the wrestling world about the Calgary screw job and how the elephant really is. Hey, we're back in Calgaria. <laughs> Where are we now, Pokemon Freak? <laughs> I have great news. Are we in episode 15 now? <laughs> I don't want to fight these people. I don't. I'm nearly at the end of 14. How? How is that possible? Like, legitimately, how is it taking me like two and a half hours to get through what that video is in one hour. What is causing such a delay? 
Is me talking through the lines really that much? Does it actually add that much time? Are you sure about this? Kagar Castle's in enemy territory. They're big supporters of Pa. Well, that gives us a chance to really ruffle their feathers. Besides, this is Phil's hometown. They should uh, be open to what he has to say, especially after the Helven tried to kill him here. Still, we have to be careful to avoid those guards. Okay, so we're doing another sneaky mission. waiting for this moment I'm waiting for Phil to fucking double cross us here I'm actually in episode 15 oh my god oh my god Calgarians you've been deceived now you might want to jump into your Phil before they lose it the elephant is not all he seems oh no his tusks are drunks and are responsible for so much pain and deceit. I served under him myself, but my loyalty was not enough to spare me. Pa is... Those any paw marks are all the same. Boo! No, listen. No, unless you're with Pa, we don't have to listen to you. No, not you. Not here in my home. Big King Squeezy's here to save us. Traitors? How dare you sp uh, speak about Pa, Mr. Font, that way? Oh, criminy. Radcod is not exactly... Uh... The person I want in this fight. Oh, good. Those are back. Yeah, I'm not even hurting him. I literally cannot win this fight, but do have to go through the motions. In this video, Radcott has 8,000 HP. That's because Radcott was probably getting used by the person. I don't use Radcott because I don't like their moveset or anything about them, really. There we go. Do I, I'm not going to win this. I'm not going to try. Algarians, you're safe under the reign of Big King Squeezy. Everyone get loose for the juice. Come on, we've got to get out of here. Go ahead and run. I'll be coming after you after I'm done my business up north. <laughs> we close. But if you leave your keys by the door, I'll take a look tomorrow. You mean you actually do repairs here? Hey, Boxwood's finest sex teacher. What do you need? Wait, did you get a car? Blasting a die cast. We both know you don't belong here, Jimmy. You should be out there with me looking for him. I'm looking for a way to protect Boxwood from everything that's been building up across the toy room. Waiting to come crashing down. Him? Come on, Babby. 
do freak down and attack the elephant in his tower. But he failed. I don't buy the stories about him being dead, but I uh, do know that uh, he took a shot and the elephant's still standing. Besides, people have been flocking to past slogans. And I have enough to worry about here but with the Hubcat gang expanding. So give it up. Chacha Man can't win against the elephant. And neither can we. Fine. Stay here and chop until you're rot. I'm gonna go find him. I'm gonna stop this. I told you. I'm not interested in going after any rest lap. Sorry. I was looking for the laundromat. Oh. Sorry. I thought you were someone else. I'm Jimmy. Name's Stag. Uh, just Stag. Sorry about all the wrestler attacks, Stag. You're not a wrestler, are you? Me? <laughs> no. So what brings you to Boxwood in the laundromat? Looking for the wash that jersey of yours? Yeah, I'm here for the Hockey 94 tournament. The are the rules and everything this time. The laundromat here is an officially sanctioned arcade machine. Is that right? Come on, A-Point. Show me what you got there. Jimmy just said he has a nice rack. Did he? Is that what A point means? I mean, it is true. He does have a nice rack. Tab, what's going on? They're after me. Who, the Hubcam gang? Those rats? I'm not a rat, mechanics. Just stay out of our way if you want to keep those wrench spinners attached to your arms. Look, boys, there's some more unauthorized paraphernalia. Are you insane? Did you become some kind of militant city decorator after you lost the BW Championship belt? No, but I did become a paw wrestler. You're taking down anything that doesn't have to do with paw. Yeah, anything and anybody. Get him. Oh my god. Okay. I mean... Mm, no, actually, I'm going to hit this dude first. I don't want him armoring up and just becoming a pain. Not too bad in the fight, you not a wrestler? <clears throat> Only a thing to it on the ice. Where'd the Desert Eagle go? That big guy? Looks like he ran away. Saw a Wasteland Express running around here, cracking down non paw supporters. Wasteland Express? Is that a railroad? Do they have a train? Can we suplex it? It's a wrestling thing. <laughs> Look, Stag, I think your tournament's cancelled unless we can stop those guys. Okay. We're just going to park it here. <sighs> Seems like a, a solid spot to stop for now. All right, so this game's now officially starting to infuriate me. The writing is really annoying. I see you go all night until this is done while I go to sleep. <laughs> uh, yeah, like it's really frustrating that like I get why they're hitting the plot beats that they're hitting here because this game has a lot of uh, tropes that it's it's walking hand in hand with and I get that but I have a real problem with the fact that like despite the, these characters have gone on a hell of an adventure together absolutely none of them have grown as people even remotely 
which brought them to that breaking point. And it's really, really annoying. <laughs> That's just frustrating writing. Short and sweet would have been uh, the play for the game. That's what happens when no one tells the writer no. Yes, exactly. Because I maintain, I at this point, I really want to like this game. It, and I maintain it gets in its own way. And not like at first I was like, it's just not respecting my time, right? Because it, well, it doesn't, this game does not respect your time. But now it's not respecting its own characters. And uh, it's just throwing stuff in just to drag out time, like drag out the game and it didn't need to. This game could have been, I don't know, man, 20 hours shorter at this point with some quality of life changes and some uh, someone taking a red pen to the script. And I think it would have been a much tighter experience. And that's a goddamn shame. But whatever. We shall soldier on. We're so close to the end of this, I think, that uh, it makes me want to play a, table, a wrestling uh, based tabletop RPG. <laughs> a wrestling logic to hell of a drug. I mean, sure. But the problem is, is that like, I could totally understand all their stuff in the ring being very flat, but there are people outside the ring and they've only had one character. No, that's, I get, hold on. I'm going to recheck that. Of the, the FWC crew, only one character of that team has actually grown as a person, like in, a, in any reasonable way, which is Nuke of all people. And I guess Machacho Band kind of losing sight of things is a bit of a growth. And then on the flip side, you have Brink, who did not earn his heel turn, but had to happen in order for the story to progress. I guess that's still technically character growth, but it, again, it's not earned. But then everyone else, everyone else is just acting like a child, and it's so frustrating. But uh, let's see. Fast travel, less stupid quests, just making you go back and forth. No reason. The quality of life, the quality of life changes did help, and I wish I'd had them from the beginning. Um, this is a Pokemon like world where everything gets resolved around a single thing, which is wrestling. I know. I would debate whether they're real people. Mm, I don't know. I guess my my frustration is the fact that I can see another world in which this game is a lot shorter, has a lot more impactful with characters that whilst operating within the realm of being a wrestling thing are actual characters that have something to say right like like, like I said the only person who has actually grown in any reasonable way has been nuke who's at least turned around and said like having a message of like finding a reason to get up in the morning you know sometimes that's enough would be interesting like that's actually an interesting thing but like everyone else is just like a bummer at <laughs> this point. Um, so, anyways. I, it's it's so frustrating because I want to like this game, but it's it's really starting to grate on me in ways that are really unfortunate and solvable. Uh, looking it up, I'm amazed this game wasn't developed in Canada with all the content. Most can Americans can't name a single Canadian province. Mm. Yeah. Anyways, we'll be back on Friday with more Russell Quest. By God, we're going to finish this game. By God. <laughs> Hell or high water. Uh, I would go so far as to say all the parts where you play as Brink are completely superfluous. I mean, yes and no. They have all effectively been a means to an end, right? Um, they have more or less set it up so that Brink makes a bunch of friends who he then betrays right like that's that's basically the whole brink line and could that have been done in a much more efficient way yes absolutely so in a way you're right is superfluous but like i get the idea behind it which was to kind of show that like he lost his way and he had all these friends and then he's absolutely screwed everyone to get to the top and like it's a great way of being like revisiting stuff and showing him burning those bridges is like a way of doing it. Um, 
But yeah, this could have been done much more efficiently. They could, this could have been done with just some scenes, right? Like instead of me playing as Brink, it could have just cut like cut away, show Brink doing some stuff, having a conversation, cut back, right? Like you could have done, you could get rid of all of Brink's actual combat stuff uh, and, and pair it right down. Um, and yeah, actually releasing it as a DLC to show Brink's side, um, that's an interesting idea. But whatever, the game's already out. The devs have already, they're, they're, <laughs> they're just doing tiny quality of life things at this point, uh, as near as I can tell. So this is all going to fall in deaf ears, but <sighs> I'm just ranting. I'm just ranting. So whatever. We're going to get through this game. We're going to see its ending. Uh, and then, uh, I don't know, we, <laughs> we can all uh, collectively forget that the last like six weeks worth of playing this game ever happened. Uh, but anyways, I will be back uh, officially on Friday with more WrestleQuest. And that is going to do it for me tonight. It's time to do the heal campaign. Embrace my anger and push through. It's more... I have a really big problem with not finishing uh, media that I begin, uh, Max. I have walked out of one movie in my life. I have put down two books and I think like two games. Um, I will white knuckle my way through most media that I start. Um, and I don't know why. It's certainly not a healthy attitude. <laughs> a dancer I watch it for the plot um there's a new post from them is there is there an actual new post oh uh steam still thinks I'm playing the game which is great AP regen yeah yeah, yeah. I, I've, I've seen that one uh so yeah I mean both of those are great um, so auto AP regeneration, which is cool. And, uh, uh, auto like toggle run, which should have been in the game from the beginning. <laughs> um, both great, but until they add the option to skip through dungeons that you've already gone through and, or add proper fast travel. I don't, it, those, ugh. anyways, that's going to do it for me tonight. So hold on, let me say goodbye to the old TikTok. See you later, TikTok. Bye bye. And close that down. And now to you, my beloved Twitch. I shall also say goodnight. Uh, like I said, be back on Friday. And uh, by God, we're gonna get through it. We're gonna get through it. And then. And then I don't know. We'll do something and then we'll get to Soma. There's still time, right? There's still time to at least start Soma before the end of October. Uh, but anyways, that's going to do it for me tonight. So, as always, thank you, of course, for watching. Until next time, stay safe, have fun, be kind, and try your best out there. Bye-bye.